All right, the next example is an even root is less than a positive number. So what's going to happen here is you're going to create, when you have an even root and it's less than a positive number, you're going to get a compound inequality. So with a compound inequality, um, it's going to be small number is less than or equal to, depending on your problem, or it should be equal to, because it's also going to be the starting point, uh, is less than, less than or equal to the larger number. Okay. Um, so for this one here, since it's less than, I'm going to check the domain first. Uh, greater than, I never check it because I knew where the graph was going to be above, but here I'm going to check the domain. So the domain here is 2x plus 8, that's inside the radicand, is greater than or equal to 0. First you would subtract 8, divide by 2. x is greater than or equal to negative 4. So that should be my domain right there. Okay, so when I'm solving this type of problem here, uh, first thing I'm going to do, and once again, it's already isolated. So I'm going to raise both sides to the second power because the inverse of a square root is a square. Cancel those out. 2x plus 8 is less than 36. To continue solving it, we're going to subtract 8. So 2x is less than, uh, looks like 28. Let's make sure I did this right. Squared. 6 squared is 36. Minus 8 is 28. Divide by 2 now. And we get x is less than 14. Now, one more thing we have to actually check here is this is x is less than 14, but we know that a square root function does not go towards negative infinity. It starts at 0 based on the parent function. So what we're going to do is we're going to compare this answer to our domain. So my domain starts at negative 4. So in this case here, my smallest number is negative 4 because it says x is greater than or equal to negative 4, x is less than 14. So we're going to start at negative 4. So here's our compound inequality. Our small number first is negative 4. Um, be careful because this one, regardless of what this sign is, the starting point of the domain is always equal to it because that's that closed circle. So negative 4 is less than or equal to x, which is less than this number here, which is 14. So one thing you need to understand here is that the starting point of the square root function, that original point, is a closed circle. This one here is dictated on that sign there. So this says no equal bar, so that's why it's not equal to it here. So graphically, if we want to take a look at this, once again, just type it into a calculator, you'll be able to see what is actually going on here. So let's start by opening up a graph. Um, left side square root of 2x plus 8 um, enter or arrow down and then we have 6 all right let's just move these out of the way real quick uh, let's see if i can grab this correct part here yeah there we go all right so i know the intersection looks like it's happening somewhere over here so i'll just change this to like 15 i'll change this to 20 let's get 20 a shot here see what that does and yeah we can see it now uh, let's grab it and just make it move a little bit more so i can see it better okay so and then i always go back to the statement i read to see what it says so it says where is the square root function this blue line or this blue graph curve line less than less than means below where is it less than this number six which is a horizontal line so i can see that at this point right here it is below so it starts here so notice it doesn't start at negative infinity it starts at this point here um you can go back this one you can count pretty easily negative one negative two negative three negative four so it starts at negative four we know the starting point of a square root is a closed circle that's why it's equal to x which is less than as you continue all the way right here this value should be 14 and if you recall how we did it on the last problem it's menu six four so left, right, whichever side, as long as when you cover that intersection, you come up there and you can see that the x value is 14. So from negative 4 is less than or equal to x, which is less than 14. Okay. 